Hey YouTube, what's up? This is Ben from shouldigetit.com and I'm so excited because look at that, I'm filming from the front facing camera and the back camera on the iPhone 8 right now. You can do this with the iPhone 10R and the iPhone 10S, so the XR and the XS, and of course the iPhone 11s, both the Pro and the regular. And check this out, while you're filming, you can flip to which is the main camera, which is awesome. I'm gonna show you guys how to do this right now. So again, I'm filming on the regular 11, and you can see you can change to the uh, dual zoom camera. You can also change kind of your layout here. And this is a really sick app. It's called Dualgram. I'll leave the link in the description. I'm not getting paid. You can see the watermark still on here. I didn't buy the full version yet, but it is only um, eight dollars for a lifetime uh, membership. Let me just put in my password real quick. Boom. All right. So let's check this out. The way you're going to set up this app is you go to the app store and you download the app called Dualgram. I'll leave the link in the description. You can see it. Well, that's really close to my face. You can see it right here and I'm in the settings. So we'll just go to the regular screen and you can see these are the controls for Dualgram. So we have both our back camera and our front camera. We can't use the super wide yet, so that is not yet an option. It's kind of hard to frame with two phones, uh, but we can't use the super wide option yet. We can do the 1X or the 2X. We can also turn on the flashlight on the back of the phone, and you can, of course, flip which camera is the main camera. So we have the selfie cam and then the back camera in the back, or we can have the back camera and the selfie cam. So it's super cool, and then you can change the layout, so you can do like a half and half type of situation. You could also do uh, basically two thirds and a third, or you could do this mode and then change the uh, circle or square up top or rectangle so it looks exactly like FaceTime. Now the super cool thing is if we go into settings, you'll see there's an option. It is a premium option, but you can save the original footage, whoops, from the back camera and from the front camera, um, or you can save it together. And that's what I'm doing on this video. I'm filming this all on the iPhone 11 and you can save that footage separately and have a bunch of it. Now, a couple of things, the frame rate isn't super fast. It seems like it's filming at 24p. You can see the blur in my fingers when I go like this, so it's not filming at 60p, but that's fine because it's filming from two cameras at the same time. I'm not sure if it's in 4K, we'll see when it uploads. And of course, without getting the premium version, you'll have the watermark that it's made on Dualgram, but I think the sound quality is decent. I'm not sure if it's recording from the front mic or the back. I don't know if it changes as you change the camera. So let's see if when I flip this, it changes the audio. So here's me talking with the front camera main, and then here's the back camera. I've been waiting for a feature like this forever because finally you can film both you talking into the phone and what's behind you. It's super cool if you're filming like family video or taking a picture, you could do it with yourself in it and also your family in the shot. I think it's awesome. Uh, if you guys have any questions or any recommendations for different apps that do this, let me know. I'm gonna download Filmic Pro, which will let you do three cameras at the same time, I believe, um, and in much better quality. But for a free app, I think Dualgram's pretty cool. I actually found out because the guy who made it commented on my last video. If you guys like this, make sure to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Leave a comment, give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching, peace.